Johnny's defeat tonight, but plenty of positives to take from that game. Uh, yeah, um, a few negatives. Obviously, we were a bit disappointed in our performance tonight. Um, all performances so far have been, been really good. To, tonight was a little bit below what we've done, but like I said, we've played, played five games in a short space of time, so um, my caught up was a little bit. But yeah, there was um, quite a few positives and a, a few things for us to work on, but it's probably better these things popping up in, in pre-season and just a couple of uh, tactical and uh, technical things we need to work on but yeah um, obviously we'll go back and try and work on them before the start of the season. How are you finding the pre-season schedule obviously coming back early and then now just playing these games over the last couple of weeks how is that it's a bit, a bit different to some years? Yeah different yeah I've had quite a few pre-seasons now it's the first time I've done it this way but it's been feeling good so far and um, yeah getting, getting through some games and getting fitter so looking forward to a a good game, obviously um, Thursday, and then we've got Walsall and Port Vale, which will be two two good games leading into the season. So hopefully by the time um, Solly all comes, we'll be fit, ready, and um, ready to go. How do you rate the squad of players in terms of in terms of the characters in there? I mean, I know you played with with a couple last year, Kingsley James, for example. You know these these players. How, how are they How are they settling into the squad and yourself? Yeah, very good. I've really enjoyed it. Uh, the gaffer and uh, the coaching staff have been brilliant. And the players have as well. The, the gaffer's really bought into getting. Um, Good, good players, but um, good people as well. And you know, like I say, I've played with quite a few lads: Olsey, Paul Turnbull, um, Kings of James, and they're great lads. And you saw it tonight. Sometimes it didn't work out for us, but we we worked really hard tonight, and we even limit limit their chances. And obviously, disappointed for it to be one all at half time, um, disappointed in the end result, but thought we stuck at it, and there were plenty of positives, like you say. And how are you finding it with your central defensive partner this season, Ryan Astles as well? Yeah, Ryan's got his um, yeah good centre half. He's got lots of abilities. Good on the ball. And he's, a, he's a great defender. So yeah, he's got a lot of potential. And obviously, knowing, knowing from playing against him last year, where he performed well in a lot of the games and reading uh, the reports, he did well. And I think he, he'll kick on and hopefully um, I can help him by playing alongside him and pass on a bit of my experience and knowledge. And it's been great so far playing with Ryan. He's a, he's a great lad and someone who works hard and wants to learn and wants to improve and push on to the next level. You mentioned that Solihull game. How how excited are you for the start of the new season coming up? Yeah, excited. Uh, don't get too excited about the first game because they're all the same, but it's better. I'm just looking forward to getting the first game uh, with three points get out of the way and then getting into the, the swing of things because it's great playing Saturday, Tuesday and picking up points and trying to achieve something come the end of the season.